building this facility and designing this facility like we have and even working with Epic and Brandon and those guys, we're to stay in the vein of our values and who we are so that uh, when people walk on our campus, it's not a bait and switch. It's They say they're authentic, they say they're real, they say they create irresistible environments and we were able to connect uh, in a very real way. I think uh, the thing about Epic that I love the most was just Brandon's uh, approachability uh, in the whole process. We spent countless hours on the phone going back and forth. He, you know, I'd have questions, he'd have answers. And I think just having that, you know, somebody who's just really cared, he really wanted to have our vision come to reality. And I think somebody like Brandon was, was great in that process. So. Different elements that we use, including lighting, audio, visual, anything like that, it's so important. Walking in, if you're unchurched, the lights are low. Like having the ability to adjust your environment and be able to make people comfortable, it's just changed the game for us. Because we just want people to come in and just just let, let their guard down, just trust. They were here for weeks at a time. Um, we got to know their team very well, became friends with them. And then Brandon came in um, when we actually launched and they helped run our first service and train our guys here, which was invaluable to us because of everything else that was going on with the building. We needed to know that our audio and our, everything visually was going to be acceptable and appropriate and up to par. We, we have this internal motto that really drives us. Every seat matters. So we don't average it to the middle. We start with the back and the front and try to make those experiences as good as they can be and as even as they can be, as connected as they can be, so that uh, it, it's really simple um, for the vision on stage to translate to every seat. As we reached out to Epic, one of the things that was valuable to me is that they listened to what we had to say, what we wanted to accomplish. Um, watched, I think Brandon watched a half a dozen messages online, uh, saw our culture, who we are, and tried to take the current room that we're sitting in and, and the current auditorium and tweak that in such a way that fit everything we said we wanted to be and who we currently were and take that to another level once we became permanent. So in dealing with Epic, a couple things we learned is that um, what we wanted mattered. And so it was important to me to find someone who understood our mission, our vision, our values, our communication style, our worship style, and connect that to our community. And so Epic was able to do that.